shit coin number 951. And uh, such a shit coin, the coin gecko doesn't even want to show me it. <laughs> but okay, Brock here not looking too bad. July of 23, one, two, three, four, five, right? Wave two. Some sort of A wave, or sorry, B wave, right? So A, B, and then maybe C wave yet to drop back down to one of these two areas, right? So I would say Brock wants to go back down to about six cents or four cents. Four to six cents, Brock wants to come back. Uh, it's currently eight cents, right? So, yeah, if we see four or six or so cent Brock here, just in terms of Elliott wave pattern only, right? One, two, three, four, five, and then a wave two, right? And then we get the wave three, where this would then go boom, crazy up and to the right, possibly, right? All its circulating supply is apparently out. That's a good thing, all right? But what the hell is Bitrock? What is this? All right, what kind of what kind of sales pitch you got for me? Build without limitations. Bitrock is an Ethereum IBFT 2.0 proof of authority. Oh Jesus Christ! Uh, down bad already. Side chain with near zero native gas fees and lightning speed block times. I hate these uh, proof of stake and proof of work is all we need. Proof of authority is kind of bullshit, but not kind of it is bullshit. All right, uh, but we're gonna have it, right? <laughs> Uh, on top of having a cost-effective, scalable, and high-speed infrastructure, Bitrock will have a, a unique multi-chain DEX swap where cryptocurrencies can be traded directly on their native chains with, without the need of DEX. Native chains um, hold native tokens, pay gas fees. I mean, we already got that with ThorSwap. All of the former uh, can be handled by Bitrock's native multi-chain DEX. So they want to sell you the dream. Right. And then they want to sell you the dream with proof of authority, which is something that Amazon would use if they got into crypto. Right. Which is basically, you know, um, just a way to, to not to have a less decentral or basically uh, trying to make it look decentralized when it's really not decentralized is, is really what proof of authority is, in my opinion. Um, but um, yeah, I don't think this is going to go much of anywhere personally. But could they, you know, make a narrative and get a, a small community going and building up here for a wave three or five? Sure. Right. Pattern still looks good. Tokenomics doesn't look too shabby. You know, you get some pumping numbers on this thing and boom, there you go. So I, I wouldn't really want to hold this long term. But if it got low enough in October towards one of these most recent lows, I would look to buy some potentially. Right. And then let it just do its thing and then look to sell it past 25 cents. So let's say you got it at 5 cents, right? You start sell you sell your original principal at 25 cents on a 5x, right? Not too shabby. And then as you go up on this past 25 cents, right? Uh once you get anywhere near 50 cents, which would be a 10x from your average of 5 cents, you sell, right? So that's what I see there potentially with Bitrock. Um money making opportunity, but in the very very short term and you sell the shit out of it. 